Welcome to Jenkins Platform Special Interest Group. It's the 3rd of December, 2021. Today's topics, PowerPC agent and support for PowerPC, Docker agent structure improvements on as being discussed in the Gitter chat, and just a note on two other items. So on the PowerPC agent, uh, our ci.jenkins.io system has access to a PowerPC agent that's kindly provided by IBM. They've needed to reset the virtual machine, so they're in process of resetting that now. That reset should complete, we assume, by early next week, and then we'll reconnect the agent so it's available. Uh, in terms of Docker image support for PowerPC, it's not yet viable with QEMU, which is what we use for ARM64 support and for System390 support. Um, right now, we're just going to go ahead and wait for that. We want the the fix for the specific issue so we don't have to use dedicated hardware. If ultimately it doesn't get fixed and there's passion for it, someone could go ahead and implement to use the dedicated hardware that we have on ci.jenkins.io. It would also have to be extended to do the same thing on Trusted where we actually generate the production Docker images. Uh, there's an ongoing discussion in Gitter chat for uh, Jenkins Docker agent uh, images. And the, the discussion is that, hey, the current re repository structure with three different repositories may be better suited ultimately to go to a single repository. Looking forward to that progress. Watch it in Gitter chat. Nothing to report on Java 8 end of light alternatives compared to last meeting. See the notes from last meeting. Nothing to report on multi-platform support blog post. I'll take care of that one not too long from now. Thanks everybody, and we'll see you again. We will cancel the next meeting. No, we'll have the next meeting. It'll be the 17th and skip the one after that. Thanks.